Today on After Drive, could you buy every car you ever wanted for 25 grand? Of course not. But are there cars you could buy for 25 grand that would satisfy every need and every want you could possibly have for a car? That's today, the $25,000 challenge at Classic Car Club Manhattan with Mike and Zach. What do you think of that? After Drive. That was good. One more time? Yeah. No, that was that's great. Good. Nailed that's it. One? Okay, nailed it. We've done this game before, and I think last time we did it with $116,000. Yep. A lot of feedback on that one. People had yeah. fun. I had fun doing it. Yeah. It was fun, yeah. um, but we thought we would kind of make it a little harder. Yes. Um, by felt- taking the dollar value down. These are the, the rules of the game. Rules of the Have game. to go to eBay. Um, generally, we go to buy it now prices, but... Um, you know, or, there, or if you're or, if scientific it's pass. Uh, process to how you can interpret that. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a uh, um, if you're a car buyer by uh, trade, yeah. or you know if you have some specific uh, set of skills. Here's how I do. <laughs> these are the these are the rules I apply to myself. Buy it now price, that's the price. Okay. Um, if it's above the reserve and it's going for that number, that's the number I use. Okay. If there was a make an offer, yeah, I reduced the price by about fifteen percent. Okay. I don't you know could math, do that. So I assume what I did was about ru- 15%. Yeah, well, that makes sense. I mean, our rules are sort of, yeah. you know, Last time I remember you guys played a little a little loose on them. We did play a little loose. Mm-hmm. But I mean, it was 116 grand. Yeah, I think you know. Zach was buying a car he was actually selling. Yeah, that was that was a plug, bit of a plug with Zach. Yeah. I picked that car and I didn't yeah, even yeah, know yeah, it was yeah, this, right. it was him selling it. Yeah, well, you know, I Zach do. mostly only sells good cars and he is of the highest quality. Yeah. I only I only guy. buy cars I like. Yeah, right. See? All right, so the, the rule is 25,000, yep. right? That's all. You get as many cars or as few cars as you want for 25,000. You have to sort out all of your driving requirements for $25,000. You could do that with a limousine. You could have five cars. Right. Um, the other thing is they have to be on eBay at the moment. Right. Last time I had a really good time. I, I must have spent a month on that post because people kept on saying, oh, I found this, this, and this. Yeah, and there yeah. are a lot of great cars. Yeah. But a lot of people are just like, I would get this, I would get this, but they have to be on eBay. Right. So there are a lot of cars I would have bought, but they yeah. weren't on eBay. Right. Or, or, or at least give us a real example. Like, don't just say, oh, yeah, I can buy a you know, Supra for 18 grand. Right. Show right. us one. You know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because that actually was fun for us going to the comments and seeing because yeah. I mean honestly the response on the comments was tremendous yeah, so it was and great so fun. many really good yeah. car choices some people put it. a lot of work into it, a lot of work yeah. so to acknowledge those who put their you know hard you know hard work into picking those cards for the comments we did read them all yeah so there you go yeah and one um, of the comments was this is a lot of money so twenty five thousand dollars I have to say I found this I found this to be a struggle. This is hard. But I think I was grand. successful. All right, so you're going to go first. I'm going to go first. OK. So when I approached this with only $25,000, I, I started with the sharpest end of the pyramid. Right. So I'm married, have no kids. I think some marketer would call me a dink. <laughs> some I, you know, other people might call you a dink. Also. I get offended. But <laughs> I don't have to have kids move around. I don't have all of that. So um, for me, it all started with the race car. You need a race car in the fleet. Right. I was desperate for a spec Miata, as I've said before, haven't won a race in one yet. So until I do, I don't upgrade. But there were no spec Miatas out there. So I started my search out and I found a Mazda RX-8. It's 12,009. There we go. There it is. Right it was 12,009. No offers. So he said, make an offer. So I said 12,000 even. I thought that that was really fair. That would be the negotiation of a car, right? Wow. Well, tell me so, about this. What is this? So this one is in it's one, it, it's a lot of car for 12 grand. Yeah. Um, it's an RX-8, obviously. It, it has a log book. It raced one race and one. It's registered for SCCA. It also says chump car. Don't think so. I, I mean, you could race it in a chump car. I mean, there's yeah. some, a chump car is sort of becoming a little more elevated in yeah, car level. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's well, yeah. <laughs> But <laughs> I could, you know, it's, it's, um, it's, it's, a, it's a race car right there, and I think it's, you it's know, there were, there were other things out there, but I think this is something I could, I could drive competitively, although it's not a Miata. But so I, rotary, right, in terms yeah. of maintenance. Oh, uh, oh, listen, yeah. you pay other people for that stuff. Okay, all right. Like, it, 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 if, you, if, you, if, you, if you spend the 25 grand, get all the cars, yeah. and they all blow up a week later. Yeah. You know, That's a lot true. of the other race cars, there's like an E30 M3 out there, but you know, those things are old and a great car, you know, I'm going to get flamed and all that. But all right. pretty modern, pretty well worked up, ready for SCCA, re- makes all the regulations, it's good for me. All right, a $12,000 race car. So now that I sorted out my primary primary need in a car, I all went right. to my daily driver. Okay, here we go. So I fought this one long and hard. I didn't want to go like the E30 route and all that, but I, so I looked at Z4 M Coupes, great car, fun to drive, but I already spent 12 on a race car, I had to fit this in here. So 
I found a uh, E30 wagon. I'm trying to push wagons it's, in America a little bit more. There you go. It's a pretty cool thing. I think I'd look wow. sophisticated in it. Very few of these on the road. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you definitely is that? And I have a, you know, I ride bicycles and stuff, so I can throw them in the back, put it on the roof, move some people around. Zach has a good point. How much? What do you think? I don't know, I would have thought, just in rarity, I would have thought that would have been 20 grand itself. Oh, I got that for $8,250. Wow. Buy, buy it now for right? 72 people watching, you know what that means? What? 72 um, ballless people are watching it. <laughs> if you're watching it, just buy it. It's, you know, $8, I, if you have $8,200. Well, okay, now it's what about... It's probably got some spurious title thing. But, but you're going like, to... I was just going to say, like, that's the problem <laughs> with this car. Let's you're going to have I don't to, think so. You're it shows euro plates. The price says... Paperwork will be delivered when you pay me. You're going to go to Clean the DMV. Title, lots of upgrades, brakes, new battery. It is older than, actually, 89. The headliner is, is, the headliner is sagging. Here's the thing. You 1989, just the you just hit the 25-year rule. Yeah. So, you know, you should be able to um, register without too much trouble. It has a Momo steering wheel, which is kind of wanky. It's always cool. And it has, like, chrome bezel um, uh, gauge upgrade. Don't like that That's either. There. But whatever, it's oh, got yeah, that. Yeah, the, the gauges it's got, yeah, it's got that wacky. snazzy net, so your you schnauzer know, doesn't go flying through the window. It's kind of, <laughs> and it was a manual. I found another one. Yeah. I found another touring, um, but it was automatic, so I had to pass okay. that one off. Got I, I, I like, I, you know, I like wagons. I'm, um, I'm, I'm down. I, 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 might, I might buy that. I'm not after a worshipper of wagons, but I <laughs> like. You 72 it. watches. You just got burned because Zach's gonna buy it. That's what we do. Oh snap! See that? All right. Okay. What's next? Cool. After so, that, I got a, oh. a GMC Yukon. It's ugly, but yeah. I'm working on a budget, and I got to pull my race car around. Uh, I guess that's right. A point, it's two grand. Geez. I couldn't find like two a pickup truck. Yes, it fit in the budget. It fit in the budget. This is. I mean, granted, it's it's a you. It's ugly. It's ugly. Look, it's I could throw tires in it. I could I could throw anything I wouldn't throw in that. Right. Pristine, right. beautiful. Right. So you still have two or two and a half or three thousand dollars left. What do you? Uh, what's, what wow! Do you, well, look at that's, I, that's, yeah, that's, yeah. that's a crime has happened. I think this was peed on. <laughs> Could have been. I'll have to get a love joy or man love from uh, Oh, oh look, at that look at the seat. Oh. <laughs> it's a it's a truck. Yeah, okay. All don't, right. don't be don't you be just need to You guys good. you guys are getting soft in your own. All right, all right, I'm, I'm all giving right. you a sheepskin seat cover. Yeah, thanks. For my birthday. Yeah. We're good. Then with my two grand left, I got a deuce and a half <laughs> military truck. <laughs> okay, Sarge. Mostly mostly just because I want to say deuce and a half. I think that's got some serious it's, alignment issues. Yeah, there. well oh. it doesn't work. It's, it's a project car. It has rear steer like the GT three. Yeah. Um, it's, it's a project car, but you know, it could look good in the backyard. Okay, Mike, so for 25 grand, you got the uh, RX-8 race car. race car. You got the, uh, the BMW 3 Series Touring, looking, 1989. Looking classy. Looking kind of classy, yes. <laughs> with the Schnauzer catcher in the back. <laughs> yeah, so um, make sure you get the Schnauzer ca catcher uh, option. You got the ugly ass Yukon. I did get the ugly, it's a bit of a rapey mobile. The rapey Yukon. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Um, and the, uh, the deuce and a half uh, army vehicle. Yeah, I think I might um, El Camino the Yukon. Oh. The Yukon Amino. That would be, um, It'd be probably like a, extra like a big Bronco, hundred. like an OJ Bronco at the top off. <laughs> okay, so, the tires in. so that's about 25 grand. I mean, that's 24 and a half. 24 I think. and a half. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Zach, you're up. All right, so I am once again like embarrassed by Mike's uh, no, no, no. No. incredible creativity here. Because to, 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 to be fair, when we were kicking this around last week, I happened to be in a car that I had just sold for 26 and a half, and I was like, Man, what better car could you buy for twenty five grand? I'm sure you could find one for about twenty five. Yeah. And uh, and that I had all, all the time I had in my mind one car twenty five grand. Right. So today I found that car and I found one cheaper and then I learned it's supposed to be multiple cars, so I kinda well, squeezed in a it daily drive. Well, it has to be. but I had to cover off all my driving needs. So oh, it's got, right, got right, you right, can got borrow it. my race car. All right. Well, that's okay. Team. Well so but I can take this to track and I won't race, but Okay. What so when I had that best car for 25 grand, it was, I, was driving, I was driving a first generation Cayman S. Yeah. And what an awesome car for yeah. $25,000. I mean, like, you know, we'd, we'd been driving the new GT3 and I hopped in that thing, seven years old, 50,000 miles, and I still loved it. It was an amazing car. Yeah. Um, I, I think that's one of the highest rated classic car club cars in history. Yeah. The Cayman? Cayman, Cayman yeah. is just such a good driver's yeah, car. Yeah, really is. Yeah, awesome. real driver's car. It makes really good. Like this was bone stock. It makes yeah. really good noise. It's just really fun. I mean, it's so, a purpose-built sports yeah. car. Like yeah. it's hard to find a sports car now that's got a platform specifically built as a sports car. I like I mean, Caymans, Caymans and Z4 M coupes. I put yeah. them in the same kind, of, and I think sure. they're just lovely, stripped down, simple sports car. The Cayman but. is at another level because yeah. it's lighter and it's it's a you know Porsche really. 
I, I mean, they've done. Sort of <laughs> 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 well, Porsche exactly. Cayman. Uh, yeah. the pros and cons. Z4 yeah. M Coupe. Versus yeah. uh, the, uh, well, yeah. the clown shoe, which obviously is a car that we can do um, another episode. Do another episode. Okay. Okay. Anyway. So, anyways, so cool. Good yeah. job. And what's your yeah. other car? All right, well, so, but let's finish this one out. So I, I thought I would find them for 25. I found this one, buy it now for 21.4. So I'm yeah. saying I'm gonna buy that car for 21. I'm sure there's something really wrong with it because it's <laughs> way too cheap, um, but, you The know. intermediate shaft bearing? Yeah, oh, maybe. Uh, intermediate, yeah, yeah. What is it? Shaft. Yeah, the intermediate shaft. Hurricane That's not the, it probably has the engine. Intermediate but shaft the, problem. The engine's probably held together with glue or something, but I'll it enjoy it for a little me. before it blows up. Well, 69,000 miles, it's, you know. Yeah. Look, they're fantastic cars, and it's worth every penny of the five or six grand you would spend to get a new engine. It says in both. Oh, if man. you had to. It says yeah. in both. Oh, I wish. I wish. Eight, eight grand? Uh, I have some experience in that, and it's a lot more. But we'll say that's another more? show. <laughs> yeah. 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 It says um, it says in bold, drives as good as it looks. So, yeah, so it must be great. It has it's to be good. Five or six grand without labor. I'm just yeah. figuring you guys just don't pay for labor. Yeah, yeah. But we'll, you do pay for it. will be another. This is another episode. Now. Anyways, Porsche came in twenty one thousand right, dollars. You cannot beat that. All right. What's your second car? The second car is. Uh, oh. Yeah, I, I do have. I have two kids, Ooh. and I got to get them around. And I need some reliability and some utility. And yeah. usually that would be a wagon. I didn't find desirable wagons for the $4,000 I had left that. over. Right. But I did find a 91 Ford Bronco Silver Anniversary Edition with a fuel wow. injected 5.0. OJ spec. Ooh. That's just been rebuilt, you know, rebuilt 5,000 miles ago. Really nice. For five grand, I'm, I'm being a little ambitious and I can get that for the four I have left over. Well, you know, oh, so you're going to try to talk him down See from five? Again? See, yeah. it's, it's the Zach, yeah. it, it's the so anyway, it's Zach play. Yeah, or I'm going gonna, gonna to borrow $400 from him and I'll see what you have left over and I'll be okay. You could, you could pick up a hunting habit. With that it's really, yeah. honestly though, this, cool. is a, this is a very cool car. Yeah, that's little, pretty cool. Little tip for Bronco buyers like you, yeah. that rear gate is the first thing to rust away. Usually, oh, yeah. They, yeah, that one looks great. Yeah. Look it looks that. pretty good. It's beautiful. It's yeah. And it's a Massachusetts truck, so. Yeah. It's the Cayman for twenty one grand. Sensible yeah. sensible driver slash track car. Uh, yeah. 07, was it? It was yeah, an 07, 07 Cayman. Cayman S. Cayman S, obviously. With the yeah. Um, yeah, no, that's fantastic. Um the Bronco? Yep. Uh, all right, so we've laid all our cards on the table. What have you got? All right, all right. So so I um I didn't go with the hardly any cars. I actually sort of did more what you did. You always go for like 80s, late 70s. Here's like the thing. Boats. Like, I didn't want to do that this time, but it it ended up that way. You are listen, <laughs> boats. So I didn't you, pick any boats. You be no boats of cars. You well, like land yachts. That I did. <laughs> so you be you, Spinelli. Or here's what I did. I I set some limits for myself. No Miatas, right? No MX-5s. You know, yeah. the answer to every question. anti Yeah, yeah. And no three series BMWs because like that's a little bit too easy. No yeah, offense no, because no, you did no, pick a touring. Sorry, I, I know, I know. But it's, it's it's the slash drive community. And we all know they're great. Well, cars. no, but it's just the, their like, go-to. I, that I tried not to go to the go-tos. Right. All right. So here we go. Ready? First car. So you look like a '70s alcoholic Boom. driving around. <laughs> look at that. Wow. That's right. It's pretty cool. Yeah, that thing looks pretty cherry. What, what, what would you pay so, for that? So this one, this is a uh, it's a '76 Lincoln Continental. Actually, not the Continental. It's a Lincoln Town Car. Yeah. Uh, Coupe, with the do the doors are about forty feet long. It's very American you gangster. You have to have one of these. How do you not have one? Is this one what of these? is this is it? Um, didn't didn't uh, Boss Hog drive this car? Boss away? Hog had a, he have a no, he had a white Cadillac. Yeah. Cadillac. No, 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 no. But what what what, 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 but what yeah, color no. is that? That's like tangelo it's or got, something. It's got it's tangelo. He just dropped that some airbags is, into that thing. I don't know what that color is officially called, but it is like you it's know, metallic rust from the from in the seventies when they did like that half vinyl roof. It always looks like you just Land bought a car. Out. With a receding hairline. Yes. <laughs> it's cool though, man. It's cool. You're gonna drive around New York, never look, be able dude, to park seriously, it. Seriously, you're never gonna be, I mean honestly though. Look at look at it's wider than the driveway. It's like look hanging at the over the overhangs. grass. Look at the overhangs on that. So so far, how much was it, by the way? Fifty five hundred. So you, you have gotten the best price per pound so far. Exactly. You're buying cold cuts. Giant <laughs> giant four actually not it's got a four sixty V eight, not the okay. biggest, you know, not like El Dorado yeah, 500 size, it. but it's, you know. So is this your daily driver? This would or be, no, this one would be of your like daily drivers? One of my, you know, daily, this is like how I get to Louis and Ernie's Pizza, this maybe. Is date night car. Date night car, all exactly. Right, right. Um, it's got the, uh, it's got the louver headlights there. It, it does. Well, no, you know, that's a lost art, right? It the is. The lost yeah. art of, yeah. uh, of, of covered concealed Love covered it. headlights. So, okay, there we go. Number good one. choice, good choice. Thank you. 19, uh, it was a 76, of course. America's proud. Um, Malaise era, a yeah. lot of torque, no horsepower. Right. That's how that works. Right. 
Okay, so number two, we need a race car, of oh, course. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you so, go. So, Honda Del Sol. When was the last wow. time you saw so, one of those? So, no Miatas. Especially when was the last time you saw one of those at a racetrack. At a racetrack. <laughs> so, but but <laughs> no Miatas, so he got the other hairdresser race car, <laughs> a Del Sol. The other, right. Well, I mean... You're going to be racing Tiffany to junior high. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, I was going to play down the rule, no MR2s for you, too. Well, right? I almost, I almost look, picked one as a joke. Look, but look, headlights. headlights. If you don't do it... Yeah, I don't good. know. I, th I still think so. Basically, he, this is what sold it on me. Basically, it's got a SCCA and NASA stickers and the Grassroots Motorsports yeah. sticker. So obviously, and the green mirror. it's a guy who cares. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's from Oklahoma. Yeah, which, which I don't know what that means. Is it's that a, okay? Is that a carbon fiber front clip there? I think or? it's just two really mismatched shades. Oh of yeah, black. yeah. No, he hit a wall at some point. Obviously. No, that is carbon fiber. No. Gentlemen. Yes. Look is at, it? Come look at the on. pattern. Look, there's a pattern. That's in it. worth more than the car. You if know, that's carbon. Maybe it's fake carbon fiber it's carbon like i think he just no look it up look him. look come on it looks like once you're oh yeah he's oh, it right is. he's right but, but it's carbon it's got fiber a whole carbon look. front end wait yeah. a minute come on wait 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 let me see if it's so you? light up front we're gonna do a wheelie did he this mention fifty thousand dollars this isn't five thousand dollars what <laughs> that's not a oh come on look, at the, look at the radi radiator now we're front. stuck look at that thing crap all right here we go wait what does it say um, does it say carbon? Look at all the. Wait a minute. Look at all those aftermarket. Look at the aftermarket uh, and list. And the prices on. He listed the prices. The prices of everything he put into it. Oh. Look at all of that mm. stuff. Yeah, nicely done. Coilovers, um, yeah. you know, traction bar. He's got all kinds of traction bar. OEM carbon fenders. Look at that. Ooh. All kinds of stuff. Look nice. at all that. Look at that list of things. Nice. Hey, oh, great Five hundred dollars. I'm going to anyway, buy it. Just, I'm just just part out the carbon fiber bits. Five thousand five hundred. Yeah. <laughs> part. Nice, nice race wheels but, as well. You're right. Yeah. Good, good. Uh, great buy. Wow. Looks like what? it's in Detroit or Michigan based it's on Oklahoma. the architecture. Oh, oh, okay. Oklahoma. It's okay. Because okay, Oklahoma. Here's the thing. When was the last time you even saw a Del Sol on the street? A friend of mine had one in college. He right, had a green one. in yeah. college, a million years ago. Yeah. I mean, not you know. It's Boston Red Sox years. hat and the top off. It was a, it was That's a compelling look. So yes, so there you go, Del Sol. Yeah, wow. well really? done. You like that? Well done. All right, so yes, we need to get the Del Sol to the racetrack, right? Right. So obviously, you picked the Bronco. You picked the ugly ass Denali. I, now, uh, I see your tab. I see your tab. Boom! It's pretty cool. 78J tab. Will that actually be able to pull it? <laughs> of course. I think. <laughs> yeah. First of all, there's nothing. Would it cooler. make? Would you make up the hill at Watkins Glen? Pull yeah, the car? Of course. This. I don't know. This is a Jeep, trail rated I, Rubicon. Right. It is very cool. No, here's the thing. There is probably nothing cooler than a mid 70s Jeep pickup. Yeah. Or even going further back. I mean, you can go it's cooler all the way than a Scout. Cooler than a Scout. It's like this Scout. It's and almost. Then, it's it's about Chevy. as cool as our Broncos, but it's cool. I think so. I'll give it Very to you. Cool. This one is 5,500. So right. basically, everything I've picked up till now has been 5,500. Right. Nice round. Cool. Numbers. Nice. Um, keeps the math easy for me. Keeps the math easy because I'm not very good at math. So I just all right. So you used about 16. You used five? about 16.5. So here's the thing. So I, now you got almost 10 to blow. I was. You're doubling down. We're doubling down. Yeah. I was thinking like, oh my God, all these cars are so old. Right. You know, I need something new. And then I said, <laughs> nah, come on. <laughs> you could have so, gone Fiat 500. For, no, 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 no. You can't get a used one for? For yeah. nine grand? I mean, yeah, I guess. You probably could now, man. Yeah. We have right. a Barth that just isn't but, worth anything. But no, so here's what I did. So you wanted these. I, check it out. Boom. I think you got one of these last time, too. <laughs> no, I don't think I got a, uh, a second to last gen Are you Supra. sure? Wow. It's cool. cool. So, well, tell no, us no, about it, was, it. That was an RX-8 that I, that was RX-7. You had an RX-7, right, right. right. You, you, went, you, went, you went Japanese sports car. Yeah. So tell us what we're looking at here, because so, it's really nice. So here's the thing. I, it's in, you know, it's I would in sensible have, blue. It's in sensible blue. It's, By it the could way, be your we'll daily driver sports car. Yes. Yeah. So it's a daily yeah. driver sports car. It's a classic car yeah um it's a uh it's a car that i think is not the best generation of it mm -hmm. so you can get a better one in you know a sort of a, a one in better condition this is probably the cleanest one i've seen it's nice but, but it's also kind of super, horrible wheels but yeah uh, the wheels can be changed and it's license pla terrible. i think his license plate says high power High power. Oh. <laughs> high power. I, a little, a little bit. Of, and look, there's the owner. He's an old. Well, I won't say that. Well, come he on. He looks sensible. But I, he sets. Oh wait a minute. One last thing. When was the last time 
You saw Ooh, the blue, blue interior. Oh, yeah, velour. Blue interiors have totally gone into the uh, With the, the ether. exception of like Aston Martin. Aston Martin. They're the right. only ones that will still do yeah, it. Those will do blue. But blue really interior. Nice. This was nice. like when, you Look know. Look at that Coleco dashboard as well. Exactly. It's cool. It's exactly. cool. Exactly. Yeah, you got five cars. The Lincoln. Yep. The, uh, the race car. The which, Tangelo. Oh, car yeah, yeah, the Tangelo. The Tangelo. <laughs> the, uh, the Del Sol race car. Indeed. An awesome Jeep pickup truck. I think yeah. that might be one of my favorites. Yeah. Uh, the Supra, and what else was in there? You had a fifth one. The race car. Oh, you said the Well, the Soul. Car. No, that was it. That was it. Four, four cars. Four cars. Yeah. Yeah. Four solid choices. Four yeah. solid choices. Very sensible. And, and, and within the budget. I was a little over budget with only two cars. I, I, I'm, yeah. I had the Cayman and the, uh, the Bronco. I think that, and, I mean, that's. I, know, I really like the Bronco. You know I like Caymans, but. As far as Broncos go. When you go cool. to a buffet, you don't fill the whole plate, do you? <laughs> you just like, I he goes, want these He things. goes straight for the sirloin. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and, and Mike, as usual, quantity with some real quirky picks. Yeah, you got yeah. your, your five. Start with the, whatever that crazy old thing was. What, what was it? Okay. It was a deuce, deuce, deuce and a half. half. Deuce and a half. Six wheels. Yeah. Six wheel drive. Six wheel drive with rear steer. With none of them that work. Uh, yeah. yep. And um, ornamental. And, and of course, the, car, the three series touring. And my three series touring car, which, which is Schnauzer Catcher. Schnauzer and, catcher. and the uh, Suburban. Oh, oh yeah, and, yeah. And, and the crappy Yukon. Yeah, my, right. my Yukon to pull that stuff around. Very good. I, I didn't get a trailer, I have to say. But yeah, yeah. You so, can, so, those could be had. So, can we declare a winner amongst yourselves? I mean, I'm going to declare myself the winner. But I, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll give it to you. If, if your race car is actually SCCA sanctioned, I mean, I could, I could alternately, for the right price, declare you the winner. <laughs> but also, but see, no, Zach would then somehow figure out a way to, um, I know, I know, like, I know. make money on that. He's good at optimizing. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to throw my vote in for Spinelli winning in this one. Yeah, I'm I think I, I was really like, I want all those cars. His super's pretty see? cool. There you go. New wheels on that thing. Yeah, all right, well, th that'll be the yeah. first thing we get. All right, so we want to know what you guys will do with twenty-five grand. Obviously, go to go to eBay. You know, put the links up. Um, it just makes it a little bit more interesting. We can actually see the cars. And the last thing, last time we talked about uh, Spinelli's Pizzeria in Kentucky, yeah. which is not owned or there's no relation. No, no relation to me, yeah. But it's like a automotive heavy metal pizza place from what I could tell. <laughs> and they have this van, their delivery van says Spinelli's on it in Iron Maiden Eddie super font on both sides. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm desperate to drive it. I want to go run pizza deliveries in it. I yeah. think we should do it as a group and talk about it in our next after drive. Let's do that. So I reach out to them on Twitter. Yeah. Greeted by silence. Well, they are in Louisville, Kentucky. But they do have a Twitter handle. And as Zach says, did you call them? And I thought, no, I didn't because we should call them. I'm, this is the 21st century, 2014. Yes. No, I think that all of our friends on Drive who are watching should just should put them on blast? Jam, put them on <laughs> no, blast on, on Twitter I don't and know. Facebook. And then I think I we mean, should do our next after drive from their 57 Chevy booth and eat their pizza. I want to I do that. No, and I want to drive that Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. I want to go to Kentucky. So if you guys happen to be watching, which you're not, but if you are, you're watching. which you're not, but it, the pizza looks pretty good on, on yeah. the internet. So If yeah. all six of you could ride in, so we could go drive <laughs> Spinelli's alternative yeah. van. So let's do that. Google it, though. It's a really cool looking van. Yeah. Anyway, after drive, that is the $25,000 challenge. We'll be you know, coming back with another dollar figure and another bunch of cars at some point. Yeah. Um, Next so time's going to be fifty-five thousand dollars. Really? Yeah, fifty-five. Are you sure? Just, just made it up. All right. 